Welcome back. This is the match that everyone has been very excitedly waiting for. It's the return of Ana. It's gonna look good here. And that's exactly how they need to be playing this here and making that space, trying to take towers early and allow this Ursa to really uh, come online. Yeah, something I've seen from a lot of these uh, mid laners when they have more spam ability than the opposing. Oh, so that's happening. Bottom does get taken out finally. But uh, not too far behind here over here on Topson, really. Up top, Stomin, top spin, this time be able to get him. Yeah, down he goes to the spin of the Humble God. So yeah, sure I, they, they chose to make it the uh -oh. five as well, well right? I guess they did. Ooh, that shockwave dragging back focus. Do they have enough though? The shadow round, the boop comes out and down goes the bear. And then the mid lane, the roll Nicely in done. coming out over here on tops and he's immediately gonna try to go and just circle away. So, and then throwing out a couple more hits, but he is indeed out of regen right now. So that's gonna be a bit rough. Top lane Skylark is gonna be able to just teleport on out. There's no way to cancel that TP right now. Yep, TP's to the tower as well, so he can stay up there and continue to get that experience. Ooh, we the, see again mid. The roll down goes Topson with a big hit from Wish. They want to start getting this invasion going, start getting their advantage even more so. Bottom lane looks like the Willow was considering just teleporting out. Found themselves a little treat there. Mid. But over in the mid lane, the kick back over on the side. They take tail, no tail. Now Stolman, he's got to try to run away here from Topson. He's not going to be able to do it. The life drain comes out, but there's a blink target off to the side. Spartan. It's going to help allow Topson to run away. What else is going on? Skylark is, of course, taking that top tower. The roll in from Stoneman, and the teleports are coming out. That's a big silence coming through here. Followed up. Oh, but they have the Ravage. Even though they have that Terrorize, they're going to follow up. Down goes Wish. These Brambles holding them into place. Trying to use that Bedlam in as well. But Skylark is very tanky. Curse Crown will proc, though. Stoneman now running himself out. It's Topson clicking away over here at Skylark. No tail. To go for a little bit of a dive here. Does not have that split already, though. It already went down during the earlier portion of the fight, so they do manage to collect on the Brewmaster. Yeah, they really want to try to contest this triangle because they, they know how weak OG is. Like, Brewmaster ults down, Omni Slash is down, Willow ults down. Like, they want to try to invade this triangle, get rid of these sacks. Ooh, they're going for the roll. Pressure. Seb runs away. Everyone's just grouped up within this. Oh, the stacks! And they're doing it. They're starting to. They have to contest this here. You can see Seb getting into position. Nice blinding light. Stoneman and rolling on out. Skylark is still here. Wish over on the back lines. Getting the life drain off. Over onto Dark Willow. Needs to be careful though, because they drag right back and tricks the kids. Doing a lot. RP comes through as well. Wish goes down. And now it looks like they'll be able to claim themselves a pelt of a bear as the rest of Brame on the run. Ooh, Thompson. He was hoping he could grab Stoneman in here. Not going to be able to quite find it, but he'll find Spartan instead and chase after him. Get himself a double kill. Stoneman running now from Ana. Oh, the block comes out. Down goes the Earth Spirit. And now it is just the tanky Skylark who is left. And it's not looking like he's going to survive this. Although they look like they'll back off a little bit here, but... I don't know. Teleport's coming out. The buyback from Stoneman, and they want this kill on no-till. They need to get something from this. So they will be able to collect that kill on the position five. But look at this. Look at Thompson. Look at Ana Socks. And they're coming right back in He's again. In. They get the Omni slashed off. And down goes Stoneman. And Skylark now chasing after them is silenced up. But again, he's a big tanky boy. Love to put some more damage. They throw out that blast. And they just don't have anything to cancel out this teleport from Ana. So he is out. No problem here. Socks is going to be able to flit those little wings away. But, but hey, take a look. They still he's have got his the eye on the prize. <laughs> Skylark, he's like, I don't care. We all died. I'm still taking them. Topson needs to be OG. very careful here. They're going to try to go back in. Topson looking at Wish with the goo goo eyes. He'd love to get a kill here. Spartan, though, needs a little bit of assistance. They do manage to use the Decrepify. Focus coming back around. I hear a Ravage going on on the other side. Oh, No Tail goes down while we're just watching as they chase after Topson. He wants this kill so bad. Bad fun. Oh, so close. It doesn't look like he's going to be able to get it. Look at Spartan. He wants that. Soxa, though, is going to go down here to the big old bear. Ana slicing away over here, over at Focus. Spinning, trying to do anything he can, but there it is. There's Heal. a little battery coming out from Wish as he keeps him alive. And now Ana, he's left pretty much alone. There's Seb nearby, but there's not much that he can do. Topson jumping right back in again. Does have that shroud as he chases after Wish, but he cannot get this kill. And Skylark oh again just swinging around in the middle of all of them, throwing out the taunt. Says, come and get me, OG, if you dare. Be very careful. Our smoke of Deceit, of course, up and running. Could see a very big RP, but look at this line that they have to cross. In fact, they get the jump first. So they'll silence up Seb, they'll knock him back. 
It's not going to be able to get in that pit as easily. Again, they still have the Ravage here. There'll be the split being committed now by No Tail. They'll go and use the Curse Crown as well. Yules is going to get used on the back line here, or rather the Panda throwing up the Tornado. But everything is just so split. Look at this. You've got Pandas running after SSA Spartan. You've got a whole fight on the back lines. Focus just can't figure out where he wants to go. He sees Seb over there. No Tail. All right, the split is over. It's going to work in their favor, but Thompson on the back line, hoping maybe that he can get a quick pick off, make this a little bit easier for them. There's Third no Force F yet over onto Spartan, so he is going to go down. But they'll be able to return and get themselves a kill now as No Tail next to fall. They don't have vision over here onto Thompson, but they get the roll forward over here Seb. onto Seb. Seb, he needs help to kick back. He's just surrounded by too many of these heroes. He's not looking like he's going to survive this. Down he goes. Wish gets himself a double kill. They did buy back on Spartan for this, but now, okay, they're going to buy back now on Seb. They don't want to allow them to get this Roche. Anna needing to be a little bit careful here. We'll throw out the spit. Double damage over onto Thompson, though. He could absolutely blow up one of these supports, or maybe even a bear here. Smokescreen does get dropped. Skylark's too beefy. It's he's just, he's, he's too much of a wall for them to get through. He's just parking himself in this river outside Roche, and they're having to give a lot of respect to it. Again, now. Brambles get thrown down. Snowman should be able to roll on out. Another Illuminate getting tossed, and they have a nice position over here. Uh-oh. Skylark, need to be careful. Although, without the DD, maybe not as easy to take down. They'll use that defusal, mana. though. Silence up. Oh, the Decrepify comes out. We'll be able to protect him fairly easily here. But, okay, he goes off. He gets the Rabbit to immediately take out No-Tail. He is not going to be a part of this fight at all. Skylark still alive and out over here. He's going to need some assistance. Thompson, though, managing to find the opening over onto Skylark. But the Rabbit is already out. Nice RP coming out from Seb as they go. And they just slice through the side of Brame here. Down goes Stoneman. And Skylark, though, he bought back. He doesn't want to let them take advantage of this fight as they chase after Ana. Wish is looking, trying to find this opening, and he is just so damn tanky. Spartan throwing up the Illuminate knows that they're all going to be around here. Does need to be careful though. Topson aware that he's in this vicinity. And look at this big old Tide Hunter. They have nothing to cancel out this teleport coming out from that Dark Willow. Button. So there's a lot of different ways covering and protecting himself. And then this Blink. Like if they do get the jump onto a Tide Hunter, let's say with Omni, he can get those decreps off as the initiation. No right. tell. Yeah, the split gets used here, but Sox are taking a lot of damage. They'll turn right back around though. They'll get the kill on Snowman. And he's going to buy back. Again, Skylark, he's a big tanky boy, so they're just trying to ignore him, and they're just ripping apart these pandas here. They want to get rid of No-Tail, if possible, and they're just leaving Skylark kind of high and driver on the back end. It looks like he's going to be able to survive. Gets the Ravage off as they'll follow up Thompson. He was hunting. He wanted Witch, but he's not going to be able to get it because it looks like Focus will be able to collect himself a kill here. Brambles will hold him into place, but Stormin, oh, he's hungry. He wants that kill on No-Tail. Focus just running around. A big old angry bear here. Throws out the end right. Chases after him. Chases after Soxa. Wish is going to be the one who gets the kill to Crapify over on the side. The roll from Stoneman and the kick back over the life drain. This is a dead Anna if I've ever seen one. And now Seb, he looks like he's going to be the next one to fall despite the fact he's using his bullwhip trying to get out. That is a double kill now for Focus. He was, he was absolutely the standout for me. Him and Wish were the two that were just really surprising me with some of their moves as on a bottom. They do get they, the Bash connection. Teleports are coming out as well here. You've got Seb nearby. The roll through coming out from Stoneman and followed up with a beautiful Blink Ravage. They do manage to get the split off at Seb pushing all the way back over here. He uses the RP. It doesn't seem to do a whole heck of a lot as Illuminate is going to get tossed out. And Skylark will go down. He already got the Ravage off. Focus will go down. Oh, they are far from their is, team. They're a little far. They're a little bit too deep here as down goes Stoneman and now Focus is just trying to focus on someone. Does get a hit off over here on the Dark Willow, but the skewer right back again. He'll punish them for diving just a little bit too far here. I didn't expect to see this from Brain, but I also was very reluctant to just jump on the OG train. It's been it's been some time since they've played with him. Ooh. They had had some rough situations too. As now, RP, Skylark. RP, Skylark, he's, oh, he almost manages to get out, but down he goes. Spartan now running for his life. He's going to have to leave Stolman in behind here. As no tip will turn back around, or rather focus is uh. Jumped in over here, Stoneman and rolling forward. There's a couple of these nice hits off. Those Greaves coming in handy. Focus. Still trying to run away. The Brambles holding them Spear. into place. No tail. Oh, but look at this wish. He's got to be the little battery who keeps him alive. As Stoneman does indeed get left behind, he is going to be the sacrifice. But they do manage to get Focus out. It's a bit too much for Brame to deal with now. Well, we do have the Blink Dagger picked up on Ursa now. So perhaps we can see something... Like a pickoff, but they're moving as five here. In fact, they go, they drop a ward immediately. Here's Spartan backing off the roll forward, though. They're going to try to just take out No Tail. And down he goes immediately. But the follow up is coming in the here gem. as they turn. They have an idea. Okay, follow up here with the Ravage Blink forward. They'll be able to go. They take down Seb. They managed to almost take down Thompson. Not quite yet. 
Looks like he's going to be able to survive that, but this Dark Willow's not looking very healthy as Saxa does indeed go down. Tops are going to be kept alive by the uh, humble God's healing ward here. I don't think you want to be... Starting to get back up. Five seconds, they can start looking to go. They Ooh, know there's a ward there, too. Thompson trying to just clean up on Stone Him. Immediately, they follow up with the Decrepify. The and BKB. that is the BKB, Focus. though. And the double damage. Nice RP coming out from Seth. The follow up with the Ravage. And it just barely clips them at the very edge of this here. Stone Him buys back. Laminate comes up. They're not finding a great position right now. This is looking really bad here for Wish as he's caught in the middle of everything. Does have an Aeondis, though. He's going to be all right with Stone Him. He's taking too much damage. He just fought back. He can't afford to go down here. Wish goes down. Stone Him goes down. They don't have the Ravage. Spartan now trying to run for his life as Skylark also just leaving the area. Oh, the jump forward. They want this kill on the Coddle, and they're going to be able to get it. It's a double kill now for Thompson. And Focus. Oh, Focus. He's chasing after a fairy, and he can't quite get his claws on her. But you know what? No Tail will be able to get the kill on the bear. The way that he skewers, like he RPs and instantly skewers, because I think he knew Skylark's going to blink and ravage, so he tried to pull the fight out of that vicinity for a second, and it, it worked. Ooh, Topson going in deep here. They want this kill on Spartan. They're just going to push him right back over into the arms of OG. Down he goes. So that was your uh, one of your forms of wave clear that has just been ripped away from you quite viciously. And there's no way that Wish wants to go anywhere near it. And yeah, now you're playing versus two super carries with RP. Now he really was. <laughs> Six and one and 11. You know, he made the one little trip up where he did die. But besides that, I think he's allowed one. The jump He's in, clean. though, the yeah. pushback immediately over here onto the Ursa. That is not the place he wants to be right oh now. They even go God. and use the Terrorize. He's just dead. Down for 89 seconds. Tower's yeah, just, just getting got chopped skewered away. into a different continent. Feels bad, man. Down goes the tower. Ben. The racks are going down. Spartan is just too forward here as he uh, is going to get saved here. For a moment, but I'm sure as soon as that wears off, he is dead. Ana is just this running at them now. Sleeping Dark getting tossed out here by Thompson. I'll get a roll out, be able to go do a life drain, but he doesn't seem to care. He's got an Aegis. This, this dart is super annoying. The cast range is so far. Like, it, it actually is really obnoxious and allows his team to set up for plays like Skewer, which, bam, Ooh. there we go again. Okay, well, it looks like they might be able to get the kill on Thompson, but Stominen was just pushed too far out here. Oh, this is not looking good now for the Tide Hunter. He's trying to get himself into the base, and No-Tail's pandas are just running in full force right GG. now. Wishes Aeontis comes out, and the GG does indeed get called. So OG will be taking game number one of this series. All right, all right, we got game number two. We've got a Phantom Lancer who, in my opinion, Fog, is one of the most buffed heroes that is currently strong in this meta. This will provide that, and yeah, we'll see what Thompson is able to do as Pugna is. This is, you know, he is an absolute specialist on Pugna. This is one of his most played. It will definitely be a treat Soxa. here, but Soxa has attracted a little bit more attention than I think he'd really like here. Fodiction will buy him a little bit more time, but it still looks like he is going to be the first blood as Skylark will swing that mighty sword. Get a nice root off here as well, coming out from Spartan Seb, forced to run away. But again, he is fairly tanky. This is a little bit faster of a lineup than last time around. And you know that they want to yeah. put a lot of pressure onto this Alchemist, but they get a kick back over here onto Spartan. They'll get the stomp and uh, is forced out that fairy fire, but down goes the Oracle. Now they have to make sure they keep this right side because that's where the majority of those big stacks really are. Focus, he's starting to work on them, but OG, they know. Like, they want to run up here and invade. Seb's still not making the way over where he's the big tanky one. They do need him to be able to walk onto that high ground, but Sox is going to go in for the second. Got vision now. now it's not looking good in. for Stominen as he is going to get life drained. Skylark chasing after Thompson here. A little bit of a heal tossed out by No Tail. Seb, again, big tanky boy. Gets the stomp off. Look at this life drain. The roll in coming out from Saxa. And one more hit should do the trick. Down goes Skylark. The fusel's online. Look at this. Time for Ana to start joining into the fray. Be careful here. Saxa and No Tail both. Revealing themselves. No tail's absolutely fine. Roll in coming out from Socks. A little bit off the mark, though. They need to be careful, though. Thompson coming in hot. They'll follow up with the mass TPs. They're trying to just take that stone. They're not going to be able to. The Doom comes out from Skylark. So it looks like Thompson's not going to be a part of this now. It's going to be Soxa who gets taken down. SSA Spartan is also done. Ana, he's left all alone here. He's going to need some help from the rest of his team, but they just don't have the lockdown. No tail following up here is going to be able to go heal him back into place. Up being held as well as he gets a nice stomp off over onto two. Life Drain comes out over onto the Alchemist. They still Ana still alive and kicking, just chases down after focus. Down yeah, he goes, Thompson getting the final hit off 
what looked like it was going to be a dangerous place here for the humble god proves to be just a piece of cake when he's got the rest of his team there. All the pieces really just came together. Seth had a great double stomp. Yeah. It, just, it really is just buddy oh, system and focus. just great healing coming out as focus oh, now. He's he... got the chemical rage, but he's completely locked down. I mean, he's got Spartan. Spartan can go and throw out that false promise at the very least, keep him alive. But uh, they do manage to get a pick off over onto Thompson. So that's looking pretty good. Spartan now it looks like he is going to get taken down. But you know what? He hit his R button. He kept focus alive. And that is what a good Oracle should do. But unfortunately, this is looking a little scary now here for Wish because he doesn't have anyone to keep him alive. The follow up, though, with the Serpent Wars, get a nice slide off, being able to hold into place over onto Seth. Wish now forced away Skylark. He's big and tanky, but doesn't have any mana left. There's going to be a roll forward coming out from Soxa. Focus chasing after Soxa. They're looking for an opening, but in comes Ana over onto the back lines. He's a little bit too far forward. Beautiful stomp, though, coming out from Seb over on the side as Ana runs away. He's going to be protected. They'll end up losing Soxa. They end up losing Nota. Seb running, just galloping away, but they're just going to keep chasing after this pony. And one more hit. And it just got it's strong. God, they still had the middle tower up. My goodness. Dripping Wards get used. Thompson gonna try to force the creep wave off. It's a jump for the blink over onto Skylark. Roll over onto the back lines with the silence. Look at this magnetized damage coming out. Plus the life drain. Spartan's gonna go down first. There's gonna be no saves for you here. And that BKB over on Skylark looks really pretty, but it hasn't been able to do a whole heck of a lot. Though they'll jump back. They'll get the hold off over here onto Skylark. And a nice stomp down goes Saxa. And the follow-up, Seb's going to be able to walk away, but they've got Focus. so much damage. This is not looking great here for the Alchemist. He's going to try to waddle on out. He needs some help from the rest of his team, and he doesn't have it. He doesn't have Spartan there to keep him alive. Another slight coming out, just trying to discourage them from going too, too hard here. But a nice engagement here coming out from OG. I mean, how do you even get in there? How do you make things happen? Grapify again. Spartan standing nearby, and they have the ward down. This, this Rush guy, Lark, though! Jumping on in the middle. Are they going to be able to do it? Radiant still goes down. And then that's going to be Humble God grabbing up that Aegis. Stomp forward. Coming after Spartan. Down he goes. The rest of the side of Team Brave just running away. The roll forward. They'll get the Hex off. Focus running. Wants to get back into his base as fast as possible. Wants nothing to do with the rest of this fight. He does end up stunning himself, but he's safely into Soxa. the base. But you know who's not is going to be, of course, Dominan. And they're going a bit deep here. Trying to just get this kill onto Focus is on a step. All they of are. them, they're just running in. They all oh, focus. Is he going to make it out alive? Yes, they managed to go and keep him in, but it's not looking great here for SSA Spartan. He's trying to run. Wish, Wish is going to go down, though. As Spartan manages to get himself back, and oh my god, Ana, he wants yeah, it the fountain <laughs> dive, and he's still alive. Down goes, finally, Ana it is the Aegis, of course, coming right back up again, but my goodness, have mercy, OG. As now Skylark's got those ticks off. They do finally manage to get Seb, but now Humble God, they're trying everything. They want to get him out of here, and they do finally manage to slay Humble God, but uh, <laughs> that was a pretty big dive coming out from him there. And they will commit onto this melee Rex. All right, the jump forward again, trying to just put some damage over onto Humble God, but look at him, he's just getting sliced oh away. Forces God. the BKB out over here onto the Doom. Wish is very far in. Where's the rest of his team? He might have gone up just a little bit too far, but it looks like with that BKB up and running, he's allowed to walk away, but that's not how you want to use that BKB, because Seppi just jumps he's right caught. on in. They'll go, they'll slice him into the ribbons. Silence. Down goes Wish. He has no buyback. Spartan is not going to make it out alive either. Both of them down. Damn. And the, Sox up. Uh, are we are we fountain on diving? Fire. Are we doing this? Oh, are absolutely. we doing this, Ana? It's going right on in. He wants to go and just murder everyone. Stomina, he manages to go hold him into place for a little bit longer here. This OG is just not showing any mercy as Ana stuck in the wards. Is gonna have to get helped out here by no tail, but he's just going to town eventually though. <laughs> he's just dead. <laughs> Eventually he died. What is going Look on at his right face. Now. He's having a great time playing Dota here. Stelmanen has that hold, but down he goes as well. They have slayed, <laughs> slayed the humble god. With them being not so humble. And I mean, focus. They're just, they're just having fun here. Focus trying to put some damage out, trying to get him out of his house. Spartan, Spartan. oh, he is just... Oof. Yeah, that was a little close. I mean... 
little things in this fight, like Sox is just doing God's work. Just these silences are so clutch every single time. Seb, he's far forward, but immediately covered. The shields, the heels, the lotus. Yeah, no tail's not worried at all. And in comes the humble god again. He's just gonna burn through and all of back. Wish's mana. They're all forward. And they get the disarm off, and the Jacrapify will be able to go take down Summoner. Wish is next to fall, and they do manage to get the Doom off, but it doesn't do a whole heck of a lot. There's so many ways to keep this little guy alive and kicking, although Focus is trying the best he can. All right, they do they finally slay Thompson. But uh, Humble God is Wait, deep in the base here. Buy back <laughs> now, coming out from Thompson. Spartan just gets chunked out again. It's another 30 seconds on the clock for this guy. Focus, oh, Focus. He's trying to get himself back into this fountain. Will they go for a fountain type again? Yep. Yeah, like I don't it. know why I even bothered asking that question. They're just well, going Thompson's right pushing. after focus. They get the stomp off over onto the slides coming out from both the centaur and, of course, the doom. Anna, he wants this kill and he's got to be able to grab it. The buyback, though, immediately. They're really angry. They don't like this. They don't like the fact that this Phantom Lancer has been allowed to basically take a poop in their own fountain. Pretty much. And look at Thompson. He's like, all right, you guys do that. Make the space. I'm taking buildings. You know, I'm an Octarine Pugna. My God. OG. Oh, Showing really no mercy in this game and just showing a real understanding of how much they just destroyed the draft, really, right? Like, even this Alchemist, sure, he was still decently farmed, but the way that they just made it look like they were just nothing. I love how the game's not even over yet, Fog. You're like, man, look at this yeah, look beautiful at this. draft. And look at the way, yeah. Oh, look at they this. do manage to kill No-Tail, so that is one of their saves down. Thompson does have to be a little bit careful here because they're hot on his heels, and he doesn't have a No-Tail to keep him alive. He's going to try to go for the life drain again, but in comes Focus. This could be a dead Thompson again. In fact, yes, it is. They went just perhaps a little bit too far, but Ana over here chasing after this Oracle gets himself yet another kill. Turns his attention now over to Stallman, and he's going to try to get man. this kill on Focus. They're trying to give him a rampage. I'm pretty sure of it right now, Vogg, as they just keep running and chasing. And they're going right next. back into the fountain yet again. They're trying to help him out at this point. As Wish again. Just a wish is just going to die. Oh, that was loud. <laughs> Seb goes down for that. Oh, wish he's still alive, my friend. Wish survived. He's going to die okay. fairly soon, I have a feeling, but... Uh, you know, he made it out the first time. Now, all right, down goes Wish. Focus running back into the foul. Look at the tips coming out. The Humble him. God is back. Look at him. Show mercy. On a PL, ladies and gentlemen. And it got buffed. God Welcome bless. Welcome to the show. God bless. Spartan's got himself a ghost scepter now. He wants nothing to do with this. Sox, they doomed uh, him. He's all going right, down. All right, all right. He's finally going to die. But uh, how how long was that fight? No. Roche. Roche is up. All right. So maybe they can actually get it. In time. This is a dead shaman. So he's buying a little bit more time here. They might be able to get the. Nope. Down he goes. They've got their eyes again over here onto Thompson. He's going to decrepify himself, trying to buy himself a little bit more time. The BKB over here onto Wish, but they'll be able to root into place. As now Thompson, the rest of the team coming in hot. No Tail trying his best, wants to try to keep him alive if possible. But over on the back lines, No Tail is going to go down. Wish next to fall. Thompson, oh, did they Thompson? go a little bit too far here? Because Focus, focusing him dead. He's trying to life drain the best as he can, but Thompson does indeed go down. Step chasing after Spartan here, and he's not going to be able to quite grab it. The Humble got himself, he's teleporting. He wants to be a part he's of back. this. He wants to get some of those kills. And there's no fountain for him to dive this time just yet, so perhaps he'll last a bit longer here, but... The question is, does Humble God want to actually finish the game, or does he want to keep farming up, you know, heroes? He got the tier. He got the tower. Now it's time to go. No, for he's the just chasing sure. after Spartan. He's like, all right, there's not going to be any of these saves going on. Down you go. There's no buyback on him. Go for the stampede. He's running right into the fountain yet again. He wants Dominan. And he's got all the illusions. It's a good stun, though, here coming out for focus. And you have to remember, he does have a rapier. So that is going to be the ages going down. They've got ways to lock him down. They have to be quick about it. Nice silence, though, coming out from Sox. buys a little bit more time. Anna gets dominant again. It should be able to go clean up Wish. And he's like, hmm, I see there's a rapier here. I would like that, but, you know, we'll focus over here onto Wish. Does have to be careful. Nice stop coming out from Sox. And follow up with Sox. Down goes Stominant. They want this. They want to get as many kills as they can get here. Wish trying to run away. Can't run very far because it is, of course, his own fountain. Meanwhile, but the Thompson. creeps are just winning the game for them while all of this is going down. The GG, GG gets called. Humble God, have mercy as OG. They're looking real nice.